Uh, the best thing you can do to prepare yourself for a large event or festival uh, concert would be to uh, one thing you could do is take a picture of your children before you go and what they're wearing that day so that if they do get lost we could show it to first responders and it'll give us an idea of what they look like and what they're wearing. Uh, children should remember their try to memorize their address and phone number so that if they do get lost they can locate uh, a police officer, firefighter, EMT, some sort of first responder and when they contact them then they can give the name and phone number of their parents and possibly their address to try to get them home safe. Uh, we want your children to respond to firefighters, police officers, EMTs and such so that um, we're here to help and we want them to be able to feel safe to come up to us and you know we can help them get back to their parents if necessary. So the City of Independence Fire Department and the Emergency Preparedness Division will have two booths, one at Truman and Maine and one at 123 West Kansas. Those will be first aid tents and lost child booths and that's where your children will go if they get separated from you. So make sure you stop by those booths first when you first get there. Pick up a wristband where you can put your phone number, um, the contact information for that child and then put that on your child before you even get started for that day. We do have a wide uh, array of ways to get a hold of people in the event of emergency. One thing that families can do is to sign up ahead of time in, for our weather alerts or public safety alerts, and that's going to be through indep.us forward slash weather alerts.